right, this is what we got. Let's just get right into it. Squishy foam balls. These balls feel like they get launched with this thing, so. What's going on guys? In today's video, I'm gonna unbox and give you my review of the Rope Bat. Now this is a training tool that maybe you've seen online, maybe you haven't, but I just wanna give a big shout out to the guys at Rope Bat. They contacted me, asked me if I wanna try out their product and give my experiences on it, and I'm not one to say no to free stuff, so here we are. And after I test this out, I'm gonna be completely honest with my review, so let's get into it. All right, this is what we got. Looks like we got the Rope Bat and about 12 smush balls. So it says here, connect, correct, and perfect your swing. No hitching, no casting, no looping. Hit the ball in the sweet spot every time. Keep your hands inside the ball. Increase bat speed. Use your entire body when swinging. Build confidence at the plate. Receive immediate feedback. Download the rope hitting system guide at yada, yada, yada. Quick start instructions. Find your grip, find your starting position, start swinging, get immediate feedback, self-correct. Let's just get right into it. Oh, yeah. Okay, we got 12 smush balls here. Rope bat bag. Okay, let's open these up. So these are just like squishy, squishy foam balls. Think I hit one first try? Easy. Thing's easy, three for three. This actually feels pretty sweet. Let's go pick those up. So my initial reaction when swinging this, these balls feel like they get launched with this thing. So I'm excited to try it out on the tee. We'll try it on the tee now and then I'm here by myself. So tomorrow I'll get someone else to flip them to me. But let's go try it out the tee. So from what I've seen online from other coaches who have used the rope bat is the two big thing that it focuses on is it's gonna help with your casting and it's gonna help with your barrel path and bat speed. So the way that it helps with casting is you wanna make sure that this heavy end is over your shoulder through your turn. Okay, so we're in our batting stance, we're low launch position. As we come through our turn, we wanna keep this on our shoulder as we turn, palms coming up, and it stays over our shoulder until we release it through. Okay, if we get disconnected with our elbow or our hands, this heavy part's gonna fall off our shoulder. Okay, so if we start to get out and start casting, it's gonna fall off. If we start to lose the barrel too early, it's gonna fall off as well. Okay, so as we come through our turn, we wanna stay nice and tight, keeping the rope over our shoulder until we release it. So the way that it helps with bat speed and barrel direction is you're basically swinging a wet noodle. So if you don't swing hard and on the right plane, the rope's gonna have no tension on it. You're not gonna be able to hit the ball. All right, let's give it a go. So this is my first swing with it, so if I miss it or I suck, then I'm just gonna delete it and you're never gonna know. Roll over, but I'll take it. Better. Feels easy to swing and it feels like it really jumps off this thing. Try to hit a tater. A lot of roll over. So my first round with it, feels super easy to swing. When you connect with it, I feel like you can crush these balls, so I like to get outside with it. Let's try another round. That one felt a little bit better. We're gonna do one more off the tee, and then we're gonna do flips tomorrow. Okay, last round, all lasers. So you can really feel the difference between the ones that you hit well and the ones that you miss. It's obvious in the result of where the ball goes and you can just feel the difference. So do a little front toss now, first time. Oh. Now we're gonna fire up the hit tracks and see if it works on that. I doubt it will, but we're gonna try. So 
my overall review of this product is that it can be very useful for a few reasons. First off, it really helps with hand-eye coordination since you have just a little section of the barrel to hit the ball with. And with these smush balls, you can really tell if you don't square it up, you'll see it in the result of the swing and it'll feel different. It forces you to swing hard and keep tension on the rope and it helps keep you connected through your turn. So all in all, I'd recommend this product. I know there's a lot of hitting gurus out there who are against product like this and are really old school in their thinking and think that kids are just gonna get better by just swinging and taking rep after rep. Which is true for a lot of players who can just hear what you're saying, apply it to their swing, and have immediate feedback right away. But not every player learns like that. Some players need tools like this to get a feel for the drill. A lot of these drills are about feel and feeling the proper movement patterns and then translating those movement patterns to their swing. Especially with the younger kids, you're trying to help them learn while having fun while doing it. So when you introduce tools like this and other training tools like that, it helps them develop their skills without them even really knowing they're learning. And yes, there's some ridiculous tools out there, but I don't think this is one of them. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please hit that subscribe button below and don't forget to click the notification bell so you don't miss out. And make sure to go check out the rope bat and tell them that we sent you. Not like that's gonna give you a discount or any perks at all, but just let them know. Oh. So this is my first swing. <clears throat>